At its core, a sodium ion battery functions on the same fundamental principles as a lithium ion battery. The basic blueprint of the technology consists of an anode, the negative electrode, a cathode, the positive electrode, and an electrolyte that allows charged particles to move between them. This process can be visualized using a simple shuttle bus analogy. When the battery is charging, an external electrical current forces the ions to move from the cathode, through the electrolyte, and to the anode, where they are stored. The energy is then released during discharge when the ions flow back to the cathode, creating the electrical current that powers a device. The single, yet fundamental difference between the two battery chemistries is the charge carrier. In lithium-ion batteries, this is a lithium-ion, in sodium ion batteries, it is a sodium ion. This is a critical distinction, but because lithium and sodium belong to the same group on the periodic table and share similar chemical properties, the core electrochemical operation is nearly identical. This chemical similarity offers a significant advantage for manufacturing. Sodium ion batteries can be considered a drop-in replacement for existing lithium ion battery production lines. This means that manufacturers can leverage decades of knowledge and economies of scale from the lithium industry, and a lithium plant can often be retrofitted for sodium ion production with as little as 10% additional capital expenditure. However, this manufacturing ease belies a deeper, more complex engineering challenge that must be overcome to make the technology viable, a topic that will be explored in the next episode.